Hello and welcome back to Runner's Fortune and the Wrath of Cybetia. <laughs> and we've got Huzzah. Jamie here playing Mist and Gwenaira. We've got Zach playing Cav. And we've got That's Nick me. playing Casper. And me, Nate, the Dungeon Master tonight. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe if you like this kind of content. It's really going to help us out. Where we last left our adventurers, you all had been trapped in the city of Sipet, brought into a pocket dimension, <laughs> judged to have been guilty for the murder of both the uh, King Sipet the 62nd, Queen Sipet the 63rd, also the uh, embodiment of the goddess of Sipetia. Or so they say. Or so they say. And we're sentenced to... Um, 46 million. Excuse me, 46 million years. This many. <laughs> in the jail just off the island. Of they could have said just a lifetime and use less syllables. <laughs> yeah, except that Dana don't die of age. But none of us are Dava. And neither well, I was do gonna say, like... other beings die of age. I guess that's fair. <laughs> and some turn into trees and then come back again, so their sentences will restart. Some of them started as trees. <laughs> now probably. I guess you gotta cover all bases. Trees. <laughs> <laughs> so they put they put a, a time on it. Um, I guess that's fair. It was it was going to be forty six some things, but it was whether it was going to be or so it was going to be forty six thousand some things. It's whether that was going to be forty six thousand years. Someone really needs to take decades, responsibility or for why we're in hundreds jail. Hundreds or thousands of years. So it's 46,000 thousand years, which was, you know, there you go. Yeah, this many. You all have been outfitted with silver collars. Yeah. Bracelets. Yeah. And anklets. Yeah. Oh, well, it is 14. How do those fit on my little kitty ankles? Oh, they shrink. Ah! And they're they grow for you. They're one size fits all. <clears throat> so hopefully not that crappy Chinese junk you get online that says one size fits all. <laughs> <laughs> Every minute that you all are in here, you each will take three points of unreducible damage. Do we, we just, just know that? Down. I mean, they all burn as you're... As oh, you're okay. Burning. So, does that do anything with our resistance? Or is that the only <coughs> It bypasses the <coughs> resistance. Rude. Cool. Ow. Ow. Cool. But... Every minute? Every minute. Oh. Sucks for you squishies. Shut up! <laughs> but, out of combat, your, resi your uh, recovery takes effect. Every hour. Every hour, okay. My recovery isn't that high. I think I put everything I could into it. <clears throat> These are not designed to kill you. These are designed to torture you. Put you in constant pain the entire time you wear them. That's just rude. So, given 46 million years, it just might become a. rewire your brain to be more of a. Pleasure response instead of a pain response. <laughs> <laughs> mm, feels good. <laughs> We're all just going to come out of this with a new kink. That's what's going to happen. I didn't say that. Think on the bright side, everybody. <laughs> what do you do? <laughs> That's just... So don't let them know <laughs> you have that kink. <laughs> right. Ow, ow, ow. Fuck, okay. <laughs> so... You are than you are. <laughs> into yourselves. And at this point, let me go ahead and share this with all the viewers so you can all see what everyone else is seeing. Ooh. Ooh. And there you go. There is the prison island. Oh, boy. And great cat snarls.
So, what do you all want to do? Angry cat snarls. All right. Check for me. What? I have to physicality check to be angry? Yeah. It's rough and and rough. Uh, before you tell me what your number is, roll the d6 for me. Six. Okay, cool. Um, you can only add up to a six of your physicality skill to your dice roll. Well, my physicality is 16, so I guess I get the six. I rolled 18, so 24. 24. Perfect. You pass out. <laughs> What's anyone else doing? I lay in the bed. All right. Not roll doing that. For me. Also, roll the d6 for me. Five. All right, you can only add a plus five to your physicality skill. <laughs> so again, I can use one of the other ones, right? It's not just a straight physicality. I can use one of the subs underneath, right. and I can only add five to it? Correct. So you're going to use up to five. So if it's a 16, you can only, or yeah, you can only use five. I rolled a two, and I have a 43 recovery. <laughs> So you can add five. So, so you roll so, seven. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> so I have a 50 then. No, total. Seven. seven. So why did you ask for a physicality? Yes, but I'm adding, don't I add my bonus if you, from both? Because you can only max the D6. Okay, so. So if you have a plus three to something and yeah. you roll a six, yeah. you can use all three. Okay. But if you have a plus 50, and you roll a 5, you can only add 5 instead of 50. So how did she get 24, though? That's what because she rolled an 18 and got to add up to 6. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah, so 7, then. 7. Cool. You lay down on the cot, and then pass out. <laughs> Casper! Um... Stand still. Don't move. Can I try and death stride to teleport out of my bonds? Absolutely. Physicality check, please. Oh boy. Oh boy. Whatever. What are you doing? I don't Just know. Like, Just roll the d6, please. Like straight physicality, or can I use? You can use a sub skill, but roll the d6 as well, please. It's not going to matter. I want to do a check and see if uh, magic is usable here. Cool. Can you a physicality check, please? <laughs> I hate to. The okay, that's a 15... That, that's a 53 physicality and uh, four D, four, uh, plus four on the D6. Cool. So you can only add a maximum of four to your dice roll. Okay. So... <laughs> 57? No, no. Oh. A oh. maximum of plus four to your dice roll. And that's oh. it. Oh. That's where I got confused too, Nick. <coughs> okay, so 19. Cool. You, uh... You attempt to death stride. It doesn't work. And then you pass out. Right. <laughs> 14? Yeah. Okay. To, uh, to see if magic works? Yeah, I just want to like, test if... I guess magic is able to be used here. You attempt it, and little sparks move between your hands. And then you got something. <laughs> That's what I thought. You all awake to water being splashed on each of you. Ah, what the hell? I wasn't Wake like up! But thanks. What's the girl mother's name? <clears throat> Welcome to day two. How long were we out? Almost a day. Jeez. Wow. Okay. Jesus Christ, but only the Jesus exists here. <laughs> and he's been dead for a while. <laughs> so what happens if we try to get up? I'm not getting out of my bed. <laughs> I believe you'll find that you will become accustomed to the collars. 
given ample time. You might even be able to stand up. Maybe you'll be able to eat. What if we die from not getting to eat? Shark food. That's horrifying. Well, they don't exactly have, like, you know, inmate laws. Not have any kind of resistance against this, but since I was, like, tortured with a demon and fought it over and over again. <laughs> do I need, uh, do I need Felix line of sight not to cast here. magic? Do you need what? Line of sight to cast magic. I mean, you can't cast anything other than a touch. Nothing has a range. Darn it, okay. Darn. Yeah, because we don't have weapons anymore. You are a horrible monster. Horrible monster! Welcome to the story. <laughs> he finally got us off an island and put us on another one! <laughs> <laughs> so, is anyone hungry? Yes. No. Anyone gonna go eat the food? No. I guess I'm gonna try. Tell me, Jack, please. Mist is gonna try and connect. <laughs> <clears throat> the food is a trap. Also, roll the d6, please. <sighs> Ten. <laughs> oh, that's okay. so sad. You might pass out in your food. <laughs> <laughs> you are able to kind of shuffle, slide over to the food. <laughs> I am gonna pass out in the food. You take a bite, and you pass out in the food. Hopefully you're smart enough to turn your head so you <laughs> on your mush. What's anyone else doing? Not moving. Cav's been in this situation before. All right. Cav lies in bed. <clears throat> I was thinking, like, great, I don't have to eat because of my magic items. Well, I don't have it, so I have to, I have to eat again. <laughs> How many days can you go without eating? Was, is it based off of the skill? Two weeks? A few weeks. A few weeks? Okay. It, it's based on your... It would be based on your physicality. Okay. That's exactly how long, but... Okay. But I mean, anyone can number is better. go a few weeks <laughs> yeah. um, without eating. Okay. So anyone can get at least a few weeks without any kind of food. Cool. But not water. Correct. So you get any Castor, what are you doing? Mouth when he splashes. <laughs> are, are my cuffs like? Are my my bracelets? Are they chained together like nope. make handcuffs? Nope. Okay. Uh, um, I'm gonna attempt to bash them like to like slam them against the wall as hard as I can. Cool. It's got to like please. break. Okay. And a d6. Same as last time. Yep. 19. 19? <clears throat> okay. You uh, swing your arm rather weakly, and it hits against the wall, and then you pass out. <laughs> we hear it. What, <laughs> what are you doing? I mean, I want to see if I can study these like bracelet things, if there's like any openings or gaps or anything. Okay. Like, As you're like taking a look at them be. very careful to not move, really, they appear seamless. You are sure these are magical artifacts of some kind, um, <clears throat> and with such, they would not be able to be smashed and broken or picked through or <laughs> cut through okay. other than by something that can dispel. <laughs> Can I do like a spell work check to see if I know what these are and how to bypass that specifically? Sure. Like, do I actually know? Physicality yeah. skill check. <laughs> yeah. And the d6, right? Yeah. I think I might be starting to get this. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. You can luck it. I don't know. We're going to see how this goes. I rolled a three. Okay. <clears throat> you start to... Pour a little bit of your magic into them. And you can feel your magic does function. 
you're getting exhausted very, very quickly. You may ask one question, you have 10 seconds to ask it. Do I know what these are? Is that a question I can ask? That's a question you can ask. You do not know what these are, but you may make a guess as to what their function may begin to do. High or low? High. Okay. Um, your guess is they are limiting you. And then you pass out. <laughs> yeah. You lay on the bed for the whole day. What time of day is it? At first thing in the morning. Okay. I would like to wait until evening. Okay. And I would like to start watching the pattern that the guards take. Cool. You don't see any guards. For but, the course of the entire day. Okay. Let me rephrase that then. Okay. <clears throat> okay. That's fine. I'll wait until the next day. That's fine. All right. I mean, is there something else you want? How many times they come to our cell you to bring us food? You see any guards after the first time they deliver you food. So they just bring us breakfast. That's it. Yeah. Okay. Um, before I pass out, because I know it's going to happen, <laughs> I am going, if it's possible, I would like to take a claw and just start at one of the bracers. Okay. What enchantments do you have on your claws? Life drinker, shock, and flaming. Okay. Too bad you don't have to spell on your claws. Yeah. Do spell would have been nice. The only thing that has to spell is my fucking gun that they took. And his sword. That's true. They call, oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> See if it comes flying. Um. <laughs> <laughs> it calls to me. <laughs> I must fly. <laughs> Am I not moving enough to require a physicality? No, you haven't really done um, anything. Do you see what I'm trying to go for, though? Hey. With my claw, just slowly picking at it, at the bracer itself. Over the course of the day, it doesn't seem to have changed at all. I will stay up for 48 hours doing that. Okay. So, following morning, like the one prior, <coughs> splash of water on the face to wake the three of you up that are unconscious. <laughs> Nothing to calve. It's fine. You don't want to... Uh, <laughs> no, I don't get water, because I didn't Bummer. fall asleep. I Bummer. Didn't, you you could have faked it. <laughs> Your food is left. Not replaced with new food. <coughs> Am I still just, like, right in front of it? Yep. <laughs> just, did I drill in my poop? It's yes. now super wet, too. <laughs> oh, gross. Uh. <laughs> uh, not this kind of wet food. <clears throat> so, ah. you were told this is day three. What do you all do? All right. Cry. Yes, Gwenaira, Casper. He is. What do you do? Cry. <laughs> Does that take any energy? Can I rescind what I said? About scratching the aim the bracer? Not for the first day, but you can change what you're doing for the I'm gonna start after the first day I don't see any change. Correct, you don't see any change. I'm gonna start cutting into my skin. Okay. Okay. <laughs> you're gonna try and gnaw your arm off. Essentially. Mm -hmm. Now, <clears throat> I will tell you, at the pace you are going... It's going to take longer than, yeah. With your minimal movements, your own innate recovery will heal you... So hang on a second. ...faster than you can cut through yourself. Hang on a second. You said every minute... I get burned. Yep. And every hour, I get recovered. Yep. Could I not time it to where I'm using that to my advantage 
for every minute, I'm the, I'm the, increasing. The burn is not like a fire okay. right. burning you. It, it's a it's a burning okay. sensation. Okay. It, it is causing you direct <coughs> damage. Okay. Um. So what what I'm what I'm getting at is is this not going to work? If you are doing it without moving, without risking passing out. How? Okay. Let me let me ask you, you this. You have the capability to make more notable cuts. It will take more movement. It will take more. How many until I have to start making checks? How many claws do I have to use? But you just have to use more force, not necessarily more claws. Okay. Well, I will use all four claws and use minimal. Uh, I will use a min movement. To attempt to do that, then. Okay. So I'll I'll take I'll make some checks. Okay. Sounds good. <clears throat> Physicality check, please. And a d6. Fifteen. Okay. You put a good gash in, and then you pass out. So let me ask a question. When I wake up, is that healed? It will be. All right, time to think of something else. Well, Casper, you're up. <coughs> What's my cell look like? So, it, it's like you can see there. It is a stone on three sides with a steel gate and a stone pillar on the front. You've got a wooden cot and... Um, and a small little chamber pot. Wanted to test. Okay, so I guess I wasn't for. There's no window at the back end of this. That's correct. There's no window in the back side. Okay. Does have I noticed? No, I no. I would. I passed out. So it doesn't. <coughs> wouldn't have mattered. Actually, I guess this might be a loose thing, and I might not be able to notice it since I've, it's only been twice and I've been waking up. Um, would I have noticed the guard standing in the same spot when I'm, like, doused with water? Totally should have done Not necessarily exactly. exactly the same spot. Okay. I mean, you, you expect that the guard probably walked up and threw the water on you. And so that put them in about the same spot, but it's not like... You don't think that they appeared there and then disappeared. Okay. Because you do see them walk away after they've thrown the water on you. Are the are the bars like that, the prison style where you can, like, wrap your hands around the bars? And, like, is it wide enough to, like, stick appendages out of? Or is it, like, Smaller it is than that. not wide enough to stick. You could stick your fingers through it. Okay. But not big enough for a whole arm. Miss okay. might be able to fit a whole arm. <laughs> but Miss would be the only one. And my arms are pretty short. Alright, then I guess I'll... I'm just going to attempt to eat the food. <laughs> Alright. Physicality check. D6, please. Seven. All right. Ooh. You are able to crawl your way over carefully, and you eat your meal. You ate the whole thing? <laughs> I ate food. <laughs> Yay. This is Bonaira. Um, Mist is gonna, I guess, attempt to eat a little bit of the food as well. For, okay, first, Mist is gonna try and call out and see if anyone else responds. Just, uh, is there anyone else here? Okay. Uh, you all hear Mist. Weekly. Is there anyone else here? Does anyone else hear me? Did you all hear? Not them. That's not what I meant. Oh. Because I, I know they're there, right? I mean, you haven't seen them. I guess that's fair. <laughs> I mean, you, you, I mean, you all saw each other get hovered into the. 
Yeah. I'm here. Who are you? Mist. My name is Mist. Who are you? Mist? Yes. I think... It's hard to remember. It's so hard to remember. How long have you been here? I don't know. A hundred years? Jeez. Gotta be more than that by now. Uh, Which it had been four days. (laughs) Are you okay? As much as you can be, I suppose. I quite believe I'm dying. Um, I don't think they'll let me, though. Why why do you think you're dying? Oh, I... Are you injured, or are you just... I'm... Starved? I'm quite injured. And... Starving. Are, are you one of... The new ones? Yes. Oh. I'm sorry. Any advice, I guess? Well, <clears throat> as far as I found, you've got two options. You can either fight against them, at which point you will come to an understanding with the callers and you'll be able to (coughs) move or you can reconcile yourself and just not move Let's see. There's a price to both. (sighs) You okay? I'm not dead yet. Well, I wish you luck, and we'll see what happens and what we can do. I think my luck has quite run out. Yeah, I think I might be on the last of my nine lives. Anyone else doing anything? Um, I'm passed out. I'll wait till tomorrow. (laughs) Gwenaira is definitely... Yeah, one of you is unconscious. One of you ate some food. One of you spoke a little. Gwenaira is going to try and see if she can figure out how to break these, like, with magic, potentially. Okay. So... Either knowledge spell work or magical work check. But first... Physicality check. And a six. Oh no. That's a six, I think. Um twenty-four. Lock it. If you pass out, you're just gonna get it the next true. day. Can I uh, I lock it? Your luck has quite run out. Oh shit, never mind, I guess not. Oh, oh damn. Alright. You, uh, pass out. <laughs> Mitz, Casper, you're the only two left, unconscious, left conscious. I'm, I'm gonna attempt to lay in bed and I'm just gonna 
pray to the Sparrow Mother. So you climb up back <laughs> up to your bed? Yep. Physicality skill check. Oh boy. Yes. Should have just Get laid on the food. floor next to the food. <laughs> <I know that>. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> next to the food. <laughs> Because as long as I stay next to the food, all I have to do is open my mouth a little bit and I might get some. <laughs> Seven, 17. Okay. All right. You crawl your way back up to the bed, and then you pass out. Darn. <laughs> this is going to try and open his mouth and eat a little bit. <clears throat> you, you get in a mouthful. I mean, I'm going to keep trying. Okay. You're going to have to lift your head some. To, you're going to have to put a little effort to get more. Okay, of just I put a little game. effort into it. All right. <laughs> this guy's going to check. Yeah. Yeah, I rolled a two. <laughs> and I rolled a two. He's the one time he's like, oh, you got to roll high. <laughs> yeah, I rolled a four. All right. You pull yourself up. You're able to take a few more <clears throat> bites. And then you pass out again. Is that just how long we have before we pass out? No. That you're rolling. <laughs> yep. Alright. You all have water splashed on you in the morning. Casper. Your food is replaced. Oh, yay. Yes. Your food is replaced. <coughs> you have a two of you that have not eaten yet. Your food is left. Should at least get a little bit of it because otherwise it's going to get extremely nasty and they're not going to replace it. Question. Yes. Is silver conductive? Yes. Am I soaking wet? Yeah. No. For me, it's water splashed on my claws. Oh, yes. Can I shock myself with my claws? I have yes. that enchantment on there. Yes, you can. Does that require a lot of movement to do that? It's going to require enough movement to make a skill check, so yes. Physicality skill check. Five. All right. <clears throat> you shock yourself, and as you're electrocuting yourself, you pass out. Before I pass out, do I notice anything with the bracers? You believe they are still attached to you. I'm just trying to get them to no longer function. You believe they are still functioning. Fuck. Darn it. Da -da 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 -da. All right? What are the rest of you doing? Hang on a second. Okay. Nope, wrong thing. Hang on, hang on. I gotta look at the enchantment that I have. Never mind. I'm okay. passed out, so I can't do anything. Okay. I thought I had... I, yeah. Fuck. Can you <clears throat> use Abyssal Prattle on the bracelets or the collar? Sure. <laughs> I want to see what happens if I try this. Although, I guess some Mist's food is replaced. Gonna at least eat a little bit more. Okay. And then he's gonna try this. Physicality skill check. D6. Oh no. <laughs> okay. You almost retain consciousness, but you pass out before being able to try anything. You Darn it. feel like if you hadn't put quite so much effort into it, you would have stayed conscious. <clears throat> Gwenaira Casper. I mean, Gwena was going to try and carefully get to her food. Okay. I assume I cannot luck anything. Fantasy six. Nine. Alright. Were you able to get to your food? And you eat it. Yay! How much do I eat? You eat the whole thing. Yay! Casper, <laughs> what do you got? She's gonna lay and try and pray to the sparrow mother. Okay. Get some guidance here or something. 
you feel disconnected. You feel empty and alone. Well, that's not the first time. <laughs> <laughs> Darn, okay. Uh, did I make it to my bed last night? Is that what the... You did. You did. Okay. You were up to your bed. I'm just going to lay here and kind of just study the wall, <laughs> the ceiling. <laughs> so Casper's going to spend the whole day just laying when I wrote. Can I use counter spell on these things? You can try when, it, is it when a spell is cast by a caster that you can see that costs 15 or less power. Physicality skill check. Yeah. D6. Yes, it's a 6. Three yes, it's a 9! <laughs> Alright. <coughs> cast counterspell. It doesn't seem to do anything. But you know... The spell was successful, and you didn't pass out. <laughs> Get out of these damn things. <laughs> let me in. Let me in. <laughs> or let me out. Can't do anything. Stop looking at me. Gotta wait till the next fucking day. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I mean, so passing it out, like, is it a full day? Okay. So I, I assume that we don't really need to bother that much with keeping track of PowerPoints because we're gonna pass out and get it back. Yep. Okay. Well, I guess I'm gonna try really carefully. To cast Hurl Through Hell on one of these things. Perfect. How many power points does that cost? 25. Cool. You need you to, uh, you're not going to be able to cast that. No. It automatically fails. Bummer. Okay, can I try to polymorph myself? How much does that cost? 10. Cool. Roll the d20, please. Do I need to roll this? Nope. I roll the 2. Cool. It fails. Damn it. <laughs> Forgot to have you do. Oh, I'm with, sorry. It's a nine. Forgot to have you do that with uh, uh, when you cast uh, counter spell. It's a nine out of two. Does that change okay. anything? Nope. <laughs> Head. You feel it almost activate, and then it fails. I just keep. But after now casting two spells, I'm going to need you to make a. Oh no! Actually. Nope. Yep. I'm going to need you to make a. Physicality. Five. <clears throat> you are still conscious. And in fact, you feel more awake than you felt since you arrived here. And you feel like the grip over these things that these, that these things have on your physical well-being. You feel like you've come to grips with it. Okay. You've come to an understanding. Can I, not necessarily, like, channeling magic, but if that's the only way this will work, but I want to try again and see if I can either think of or figure out how to get these things off. Cool. I'd like you to make a magical work or a spell work check. Um, still rolling your d6. <laughs> can I look that? You feel like your luck has run out. Right. <laughs> Well, I rolled a one, so a net one. Okay. Everything explodes when they pop off. You feel them <laughs> tightening around you. You take <clears throat> ten points of damage. Ow. That was rude. And then you do pass out. <laughs> Casper, you're the only one who wants to look. Do you do anything else, or do you just keep laying in bed the rest of the day? I'll just lay in bed and just try and fall asleep. <laughs> All right, you are able to fall asleep. You are all awoken by water the next morning. <laughs> Lovely. Fantastic. What's anyone do? Twin Fang Strike on the Bracer. All right. It's a level one. Check. With the D6? With the D6. 
Can I use, do I have luck? You feel like your luck is right now? God damn it. 17. All right. You are able to hit it, but definitely not as hard as you feel like you should have. But I hit it. You did. Cool. And then you pass out. <laughs> Who else is doing anything? I mean, I think when I was going to try it, I mean, uh, both of my characters are going to try to eat a little bit again. Okay. Gwenaira, you're able to get up and okay. walk over and you pick up your tray and start eating off of it. Okay. Missed. Physicality, D6. Oh, wait. <coughs> oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Rule the night. Plus <laughs> three. 22. All right. You take one step and bam. I mean, I was still there. You, you get up and... <laughs> oh. A face flat. Yep. Damn it. Casper, it. <sighs> what are you doing? I would like to smite my arm bracers. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Go ahead and make a check to do so. <clears throat> Seventeen. All right, and did you include your D six in that? Oh, no, uh, one second. <clears throat> so it's a D twenty. So this will be a um, this will be a casting check. Casting, okay, and I just add. Let's see here. So I just add my casting plus your casting skill up to a maximum of the number you roll in the D six. Okay. Um, oh, so it's casting plus the D6. No, the yes. maximum of the D6. Oh, okay. Um, so 21. Okay. You cast Smite on it, and it's a, you know, a lot more oomph than you thought you were going to get out of it. And then you pass out. <laughs> and, but nothing happens. It, it does not break, it does not fall off, it does not seem to change in any way. Darn. Those of you that have worked on these a little bit, are quite certain these are magical items. <clears throat> and magical items can only be destroyed by dispelling it either by disabling the enchantment through an enchantment check or through an item with the <clears throat> disenchant skill. Maybe those bars aren't magical. Maybe there's other things in this cell that can be used other than the single magical items you currently have on you. Used to what? Do anything with. You guys are, are in cells and have not done much with the cells. Not that we can move that much. A couple of you have been able to move no problem today. Yeah. You haven't done anything yet. Did, did I pass out after casting that, or, or... you did not? And in fact, That's our you mistake. also it's feel nice. like you have come to an understanding with the bracelets. I assume the... you see what I mean. You saw a little cat gurgle. Because, yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the only one. Did you pass out yet? <laughs> Passed out right away. <laughs> Mr. Cap, wake up. Cap goes down. Mist eats one bite of food. Down. Cap hasn't eaten anything. <laughs> you might want to try and fix that. That's okay. <laughs> Cap is going to starve. We're like day six in. I can survive weeks. You know how much cheese I've eaten? There's a lot of girth on this dog. <laughs> He's fine. So the two of you that are still awake. Do you respond to this guy at all? What the fuck? <laughs> uh, what did he say? You still awake, little Do you understand cat. what I was saying? You still awake, little cat? I heard the cat go thump. <laughs> I don't think he's awake. 
your voice. Yes. I know it's beautiful, isn't it? It's so much really, fun. right now? <laughs> <laughs> yes, right now. What else do I have in this hellhole? <laughs> can't quite place it, but I swear I've heard it before. Well, I know a lot of people, so that doesn't really help. Jeez. I've also seduced a lot of people. So, so that nice. Also doesn't help. <laughs> you seduced a lot of people? Yeah, most of them ended up fighting each other. I didn't end up sleeping with them. No. No. <clears throat> yes. Yes. No. I, how, is, how is that a characteristic? <laughs> Don't tell me. <coughs> Have you sent people to the office before? <laughs> yes. The what now? <laughs> <laughs> Poor Gasper in the other room is so confused. He's just lying in bed going, what is happening? What is the office? <laughs> yes. Is that you? Yes. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Who is this? Do I recognize the voice at all? No. This is some ancient guy <laughs> over there. I, I'm sure I don't sound like you remember me. <clears throat> it's me. Azazel. Why do you sound so old? How do you sound so young? I, I mean, it's only been like a week. I guess it's been more like two weeks now since I last saw you, but that's it. No, that's Who's this Azazel guy? No, no, no. You know ex at that word. Oh, I do? You know of this man. <clears throat> oh, that's, yep. Okay. Never mind. This is Lord... Azazel, one oh. of the highest ranked members of the high of the high order of Delit. He I is one Delet. of the Death Knights. He is the leader of the Death Knights. A prince in your world, one of the heirs to the throne in Delit. This is one of the most important men in your entire kingdom. Someone to be revered, lauded, respected, almost even worshipped as the only Azazel to have survived out of more than 3,000 attempts. He's going to be aghast when I start talking him to him like a bro. <laughs> Wait, Azazel, as in Lord Azazel? <coughs> yes. They captured you? Yes. As what oh my the Lord, hell I'm happened? So sorry. I. It's for us. It's been two weeks. Like I've, I've been here for so long. Did you go back in time? No. I I left you and I came here and they were waiting. The Delit spies. They <coughs> they failed. They were. Damn. <laughs> unable to erase our my assassination of Queen Sipet. Mm. Yeah, that's part of why I'm here. <clears throat> trapped me in a high magic net. Hey, us too! They cut off my wings. Yeah, we tore oh, those off were my wings. Oh no. And as you now think back to the wings, you have never seen Oslo yourself, but you do remember hearing about his blood red metal tipped wings that were one of his main weapons. Well, I am not content to keep staying here and just deal with this. I have well, been we got, here for we, we, more than a hundred years. How? I don't... We gotta get him out. I don't either, but we're gonna figure this out. And... 
I'm going to try and tap into the power of the pillar that I sucked up. Okay. And force it through the bracelet necklace collar. Okay. Nice move. <laughs> okay. That's how we do it at brute force. Yeah. <laughs> We're going with full on side pit pillar shadow magic. When accuracy fails, volume comes into play. <laughs> All right. <laughs> nice. <laughs> How many power points would you like to put into this? All of them, because you're going to pass out. <laughs> <laughs> How many? Yes. <laughs> I mean, I'm concerned we're going to fight something if Gwen Ira can get out of this. <laughs> but... so, no, don't forget. I'm an asshole. Yes. How many power points would you like to use? <laughs> now I'm concerned because he's an asshole. I love it. That was your. That was the leading okay. statement. You you grab the tiniest little bit of energy, push it through. Nothing happens. Can I go with like a hundred? Sure. <laughs> How many power points do you have? Three hundred and sixty-three. Okay, so you you reach in, <clears throat> you search deep inside yourself, and you find that shadow energy just. Pulsing inside of you. It's at 100 points, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Um, and you take it. And you, you focus on the bracelets. The yeah, we'll start with the... the let's start with the collar. The collar? Yeah. Okay. Um, and you focus on that collar... And you blast it with shadow energy. 100 points, right? Yep. Okay. You take 100 points of unreducible damage. Oh, I'm dead. Holy. Is that going to kill me? How does this work? How many health do you have? 68. <laughs> Something like that. 53. Oh, no. 53. 53. Okay. You're negative 47. Fuck. You all hear a boom as Granira hits the floor. Casper. What happened? What? What is your perception defense? I'm concerned. Wait. Like, wait, mine? Yes, yours, Casper. Uh, 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 <laughs> let's see. Uh, 29? Okay. You faintly hear a beep, 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 Like it's a shattered. metal it f bouncing and rolling across Too the floor. You said to kill yourself to do it. <laughs> <laughs> it broke. <laughs> I'm going to tell Cav just, it broke. Yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> There's no response as Cav is still 100% unconscious. Uh, well, I wouldn't know, so... <laughs> as hear him. <laughs> what was that? I need more cheese. <laughs> 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 He just names off different cheeses as he snores. <laughs> uh, my lord, uh, the, bra the I think the bracelet uh, br shattered or broke or fell off. I like of, how you don't uh, even check if she's still alive by saying no, nope, no. Nope. <laughs> the bracelet just came off. The, the, basically, someone to worship is down the hall from me. That's so. Yeah, that's all I care about right now. Oh, that's fair. That's fair. <laughs> yeah, no, that's fair. definite, definite, definite. Points for that. <laughs> Ronaira, are you okay? Ronaira! What? <laughs> Casper, what do you do? Poker with a stick. Um. <laughs> do something. Um. We were all. Okay. Uh. I'm just gonna call out to her if. Um. I'm just gonna call out to her. No response. 
Um, At least Casper has healing magic if he can use it. <laughs> I don't know how close he is to me, but he can sure as hell try. Uh, well, it looks like uh, he's two cells down from you. No, he's next to you. Oh, he is next to you. He is. He's yeah. in the back. Um... Hey, Casper. Yes? You, you're you a mechanically minded guy, right? Mm-hmm. You, know, you designed guns entirely on your own? Yeah. Yeah. Anything useful in this cell? Anything you can use to build something, <laughs> fashion a weapon, something to extend the range of your uh, powers? You know... How okay? Two questions. How? Metal it's a wood bed. Cot, wooden cot. Metal tray that your food was on. <clears throat> how loose are the? Are, is there any loose material besides the bed and the chamber pot? The tray your food was on. Hmm. Okay. All you high-level players keep thinking about the sum of your powers and forget all the things that are you. But shadow magic is me. No, that was great! <laughs> Wait, you saying You that? have a thief assassin who even asked if their claws could be used <laughs> to make claws. I'm trying I to eat. eat. told them that I'm trying to eat. Hey, so all I've done is try so, to uh, eat. Have I licked enough stuff that my tongue has dispel magic on it now? <laughs> that would be hysterical. <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> and we have a mechanical engineer. <laughs> I didn't say it was a good one. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, I just I got out of college like three, like four months ago. <laughs> I'm talking about your character who designed his own gun from nothing. <laughs> well, I mean, uh, let's see. Um, Even just ask about is there anything you can make? I mean, I guess what could I need you can I can I disassemble the the wooden bed or the cot? Absolutely. It, Not any difficulty okay. whatsoever. You are perfectly adept at being able to disassemble this bed. No problem. There's even a couple bolts in there. It's nuts. <coughs> Perfect. I'm going to use them to kind of make a, well, according to the map here, um, some sort of U-shaped appendage that I can attempt to feed through my cell. I would like for you to make a crafting check, please. With a D6. D6, gotcha. With the D6 limiter still. Oh, D6 limiter, gotcha. Yeah. Um, I found my found my craft here. There it is, guy. It's gonna hurt. Like uh, eight. Eight. Okay. Um, it is very crude. Um, you're not sure you're gonna get more than one or two uses out of this if you're careful, but you believe that you would be able to snake this around and. Get it through your bars and potentially through Gwenaira's and potentially poke her with it. Perfect. <laughs> he told him to poke her. And <laughs> sick. Okay. I'm sick. I'm. I guess I gotta do my powerpoints here real quick. Let's see. Um, use that one. Um, I'm gonna try and. Because <laughs> I'm gonna try and poke through the cell and see if I can poke a what, something squishy. <laughs> okay. Or, are, you, are you trying to channel anything through this while you're doing it, or are you gonna? I'm I'm gonna try and channel revivify on through it, you have if that's even possible. Shit. Now I will I will remind <laughs> that revivify is used for. Those that are definitively dead have okay. failed all saving throws, aren't just unconscious and dying. Now, of course, Revivify would absolutely still work on a dying person, 
but it may be overkill. A simple healing I'm so spell, alive. as long as they have not failed all their death saves, will still return someone to no longer actively dying. Okay, then I will cast Healing Hands. Okay, perfect. How many power points does that cost? Uh, one. Perfect. Roll a d20, please. Just straight d20. 17. Okay. You are able to cast Healing Hands. I would like for you to make either an accuracy or a precision check, please. As you are trying to snake this between the two. With the D6 limiter? With the D6 limiter. Really hope you don't poke the food, because you might revivify it or bring back whatever that is. Does just the cat it's kind of like a little sh- a little rat just going to start gnawing on Iris' finger. Does does the oh, cow oh, reanimate oh. if it's willing around the stake? <laughs> um, let's see, twelve. Twelve. All right, you are able to snake this through, and you poke something squishy. How much health does this reheal? I'm fucking stupid. Uh, recover. Uh, excuse me. Um, recovery skill plus healing uh, plus. Let's see. Their recovery skill plus my healing skill, which is uh, seven. <coughs> um, for every one point of power that I spend past the first heal, the target an additional one d six plus four. But I only dumped one. One you point, so. One. so it's seven plus Gwenaira's recovery skill. Twenty. Yep. Perfect. You are back up to twenty-three health. No, oh, I'm still alive. So you gasp and take in a breath, and are able to go. I'm okay. Before you. Oh. <laughs> I'm alive. Oh, thank the night, the sparrow mother. Oh God. Woo. I didn't think that was going to work. Casper, what do you do now? Sparrow Mother. Um, you can hear some to... gentle snoring from Gwenaira's oh. cell now. <laughs> yeah, you are quite story. sure that she Dreaming is of no longer dying, ringo, 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 ringo. but is also no longer conscious. Ringo, 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 ringo. ringo. <laughs> um, it's so I'm glad you can hear her over Cap snoring. <laughs> Let's see here. I don't I don't know if this really requires me to Oh, it's, uh, man, there's a lot of options here. Um or do you want to rest for the rest of the day? I think I'm going to pull back my little <laughs> extender thing and just rest the rest of the day. Okay. Sounds good. The three of you that are unconscious have water splashed on you in the morning. Cool. Those of you that <laughs> ate, your food is replaced. What do you all want to do? Oh, so I'm what do I notice upon waking? Is it... Gone. Your collar, Gwenaira, is lying split in half over there. Thank God the guards weren't paying attention. <laughs> yeah, did they not? They didn't put anyone on? Nope. Interesting. You can make me go first so I can pass out first. No, I'm waiting for someone to do something. <laughs> oh, okay, Miss Gwenaira. <laughs> Very carefully sneak over to the door. I yep. assume there's a door somewhere. Yep. Do you have to roll anything? Yes. Yes, you do. Yep. It's because you've only eaten once. <laughs> no, Miss had a full mouthful oh, okay. once. Reality D6. 17. Okay. You are able to get over to the door, and then you pass out in front of it. Yeah. 
So you, so you said something. You're forgetting who we are. You mentioned, okay. It's not going to work, but I'm going to try it. I'm going to rage. Okay. Ooh. To enter a rage, you will have to do a physicality with D6 limiter. Ten. Okay. You enter a rage. Cat. Break the wall. I know this isn't gonna work. Can I thundering strike myself to blow blast the bracers off of me? You could try. Okay, but it costs twenty five power points. I'm asking this before I do it. You you attempt <clears throat> a thundering strike, yeah. and it fits. Am I still awake? You are. At the moment. Remodeling time. <clears throat> we know that the bra I know that the bracers Expand and retract, correct? Yes. Okay. So going into that would not work by breaking them off that way. Correct. Before anyone else does anything, can Gwen Ira call out real quick? Yeah. I broke the collar. How? I funneled as much no, I funneled a decent amount of my magic into it, my dark magic. Well that explains the explosion. If we could all get together. I might be able to help us. <clears throat> okay. From the other room, missed. Dead. Kicking in this. Can I take apart the bed? Yeah. <clears throat> Physicality skill check. D six limiter. Natural one plus a six, so seven. Okay. Now, hang on a second. I rolled a one. Does that mean it goes on my thing? Yes, it does. Oh, damn it. As a 20? No, as a one. Damn it. <laughs> Which of my characters rolled the one? Was it when I remember the mist? Uh, it was mist. Was it mist? Yes. I don't remember. Because you were excited. No, it was when I remember. I'm sorry. Okay. Which one so. was I using? You smash apart the bed, and you feel that if you hadn't put quite as much, if you if you smash apart the bed, and then you <coughs> slip and smack your head against the wall and pass out. Okay. But you feel, as your consciousness is fading, that you wouldn't have actually passed out. You hadn't slammed your head into the wall. Okay. You feel like you might have come to an understanding with these. Ha ha! I didn't have to eat. <laughs> <laughs> this is the only one. Casper and Gwenaira. Um, I'm gonna... Elemental Bolt, is it like a large bolt of... Like, is it like a large attack, or is it like something I can concentrate down into like a tiny... Like, Elemental bolt is. A, I mean, it depends on what tier do you have it at. Three. That's a pretty potent thing. Okay. Um, Elemental bolt the... itself is a tier one power, but you have mastered this to a tier three capability. That's a pretty oomphy elemental bolt. Did I get my powers points back? <clears throat> you did. Okay. Am I back to full health or? Yes. Okay. Is there any sort of like? hole or like key like like lock in these gauntlets or on my well I guess I couldn't really see my neck one but there like is the, not, they are perfectly seamless dang okay hmm how so these bars that are across the front of <coughs> the um the prison cell we're in. Mm -hmm. How wide apart are these bars? 
Could I, like, stick my arm out and around to, like, not, kiss them? Not enough that you could... You believe Mist is probably the only one that could fit their arm through it. You can fit your fingers through it, but, but not big enough for okay. a hand or arm. And there's no, like, the wall that's between the cells. There's, like, no hole Solid stone. Okay. I kind of will be trying to get a hole through the cells. Well, that's... If we can find any way of getting closer together, then at some point, you know, it'll be easier. I probably don't know that he heals me, right? I don't know why I almost died. Nope. Damn. <clears throat> why don't you channel more shadow magic into yourself? <laughs> break the other bracelet. I mean, I will at some point, but before I'm, I do that, is uh, <laughs> if I if we can get, you know, between cells, I can help other people yeah. get theirs off, too, Fair is the I'm, point that I'm trying to make to Casper right now. <laughs> I'm going to stand back, and I'm going to use Cast Elemental Bolt, the acid version, at the cell bars. Okay. How many power points does that take to cast? Ten. Okay. Roll a d20, please. Five. All right. You try to cast it, and it fizzles out. Dang it. <coughs> I assume these bars are probably, like, the far part kind of the end. Yeah, yeah that's, so that's about right. Can I try to polymorph into a rat <laughs> or a mouse or something and see if I can go through? How many power points does polymorph cost? One million. I want to say it was... Uh, let me check. Uh, ten. Okay. Roll a d20. Thirteen. Okay. You cast polymorph on yourself. Do I turn into a mouse? You turn into a mouse. Can I try and run into Casper's cell? You uh, slip out of your cell and into Casper's. <gasps> I want to turn back into a person. <laughs> Squeak! <laughs> <laughs> I did it! <laughs> you do still have your bracelets and... Yeah, that's fair, but now I'm in the same cell as Casper. Mm -hmm. So technically now you could tech... Never mind, I'm going to sleep. <laughs> yeah, now so. she can cast the nuke on me and get off my, my collar. But before I do anything more, if I try and funnel just a little bit of shadow magic into like the bracelets, does it feel like the overall effect has lessened of the pain? It does feel like the overall effect has lessened. Okay. <clears throat> do you want me to do one you, one me, one you? I assume we're only going to be able to do one a day. Or should I try and get all of mine off first, Casper? Try getting all of yours off, because then you, you'll you have full move uh, movability. Okay. Because I think it'd be easier to have one full than a couple partial. And okay. I can relatively still cast, because I was able to get you up. So. so, okay, you got me up, you can keep me alive? Yep. Alright, I'm going to move to the next thing then. And I'm going to try my bracelets. Okay. Now the question is, <laughs> how much magic do I put into this? <laughs> 75. Okay. Sure, yeah, I'll listen to the whispering voice in my ear over here. I'll go for 75 power points. Okay. Sorry, Just you can never You channel I know. 75. You <laughs> grab a good chunk of shadow magic that comes directly from the goddess Scythet and force it into those Ipetia made bracelets, and they shatter. You do yourself 75 points of unreducible damage. <laughs> Renaira humps in front of you. Now. <laughs> All right, well. All right, here we go again. <laughs> clear. <laughs> Set, clear. Um, all right, I'm going to cast Healing Hands again. Okay. How many power points? Let's uh, one. D20, please. Hopefully I don't die, because you're almost too bad. Uh, ten. Okay. You cast Healing Hands with one power. 
<clears throat> I mean, I assume it's the same amount as before. It, it yeah. is, yep. Okay. You have 23. You gasp. You wake up just enough to be like, oh, I'm not dead. And then you pass <laughs> out again from just the overwhelming. Oh! <laughs> I'm up. No, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm up. No, I'm not. I'm not dead yet. Never mind. <laughs> Okay, what are you going to do, Casper? Um, I'm going to try shooting... I'm going to try shooting the asset at the lock again. And see if I can not have it fizzle out. Alright. Try and rub your hands all over it. Ten power points, right? Yep. Alright. D20, please. I didn't ask permission first. <laughs> <laughs> Oh boy. <laughs> Two. <laughs> Alright. It fizzles out. <laughs> Darn, okay. Um As in the background. <clears throat> what's going on? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna eat my yeah, food. Another and thing. then call it a night. <laughs> <laughs> what is it, day nine now? I lost counts. <laughs> of course I have. <laughs> yeah, I figured. What do you do, Casper? Oh, I'm just I'm just gonna eat my food and go to bed. All right, <laughs> it's, uh, just lay down on the floor since I dis disassembled my <laughs> my bed. Link and I were in the cell with you, just completely out in the open. Where two of you are in a cell together now. Ten. <laughs> Actually, that's this. Uh, uh, that's not gonna work, yep. is it? Thank it on the yep. cross. Nope. That's why I kept my mouth shut. I knew this was gonna come back. <laughs> I mean, I'm assuming there's still shards of bed around that you can try and hide. Uh, his bed is perfectly disassembled. It's uh, just not sharded. Okay, well, still, but there was like a plank that was yeah. probably on the bottom. I could just hide me behind it. I'm going to try something first. I'm going to try and blink step into Gonira's cell. Okay. How many power points does that cost? Six. And okay. if I choose to stay where I'm teleported, it decreases the cost by three. Okay. Roll a d20, please. It means you can't go to sleep. You gotta stay awake. Twelve. Okay. Because you have to keep that up before they come back in the morning. No. No. Yeah, he just Did has you... to choose to stay in that cell. And then okay. he can stay he, he in that cell. He chooses to end it before <clears throat> gotcha. okay. going back, and it only takes three. Okay, I gotcha. Cool. You blink step. Now... I would like for you to make a luck roll at disadvantage because you have no idea where you're going. <laughs> oh God! It's gonna end up fair. <laughs> Other than it's over that way. Now you are smart enough to be able to go. Okay, it should be about the same size as myself, so it's probably oh, right God. about there. But luck check disadvantage. He's gonna wake us. Oh God! Oh no! Is <laughs> Well, cool. well, did I see Gwenaira's, like, when she was a rat, did I see the rat come into my cell? <laughs> you did. Oh, God. But that, there's not enough gauges there to tell where it came from, though, I'm assuming. Not I mean, you know it's from the cell next to you, so you you have a basic understanding of approximately where it is, which is why I'm letting you do this at all. God. Okay, I gotcha, I gotcha. But <laughs> as to exactly where you might end up in that, because you don't know exactly how thick the walls are... Yeah. Uh, four? Four. Okay. Oh, God. <laughs> that was... Yeah. <laughs> and this isn't plus anything, right? It's a luck. So, so it's add your five, so it's a nine. Yep, 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 nine then. Okay. He's like, luckily the DC was eight and a half, so... <laughs> <laughs> well, the DC was a twelve. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Where's he gonna end up? <clears throat> but the DC for him to end up with his head inside of a wall was a six. <laughs> oh, thank God. <laughs> so you didn't destroy your brain in this teleport. <laughs> let you read the cat this year. What? Did you do that? Yes. 
Well, uh, not necessarily die, but you can accidentally teleport into stuff, <laughs> and it'll not be good. Oh, interesting. I don't think I've gotten there yet. Fair enough. Um, <laughs> <laughs> no, I've known about that for a long time. <laughs> um, but as you do teleport, you do end up in Gwanira's cell. <sighs> but where? In the process, though, you do land at a very bad angle. And you do snap your leg in the process. <laughs> you have the broken leg wound. Dude, you died twice and took no wounds. He teleports once and breaks his leg. <laughs> yeah. Broken, broken leg, okay. How many wounds you're getting from this dying? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, boy. I'm screwed. So glad I'm sleeping. Once every time you're bloodied, once every time you're unconscious, oh, you're shit. four so far. Guess we're going back to the island because I think there's a healing house there. <laughs> we hope. I mean, we do, but... So, yes, Nick, you have the broken leg. <coughs> so go ahead and record that on your... Uh, Okay. section. What it'll mean is your movement speed is halved. It'll take three days to heal on its own. It'll take... Um, yeah, that's not horrible. We'll probably be here another three days. Right. I'll walk with uh, the one day bit. with a DC 30 healing check or a straight DC 42 healing check to just heal it outright. Okay. But as the pain washes over your body... You do fall unconscious. You dang it! <laughs> As everybody is awoken by the water the next morning, the guards say something you're not expecting to hear. Wake up. Here's your food. Welcome to day 300. Yes. Fuck. So is my leg healed? <laughs> Your leg is, in fact, healed. Yes! <laughs> Wait, so we haven't actually been unconscious for a day? We've been unconscious for longer? The hell of a nap. And that is where we're going to end for tonight. Hello, and welcome back to Runner's Fortune <coughs> and Wrath of Sagantia. How much did you want to say pillars there? <laughs> That's what my brain thought first. That's all right. He'll, he'll flub it up again like he did last week. And we have got Jamie here, who will be playing both Cav and... Yeah. Choto Chigao. <laughs> I want to see Jamie play Cav. I don't want to play Cav. I mean, you'll get practice for your other campaign. <laughs> Have you ever been in pi piloting a jet with one wing gone? That's what it's like to play Cav. Spike <laughs> <laughs> kids. Hey, Zach, you want to play Cav as a high level? <laughs> yeah, I do. Nope, sorry, I can't. Jamie gets playing. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs>